Hey guys, what is up with me? John Aries, and welcome to a different kind of video. I know this is going to be the second video I've uploaded today, but I figured why not about that also, because this, uh, this is an interesting story that happened from my past, and I figured it should be shared, because maybe you can learn something from it. But, uh, anyways, so here's the story. So a while back, I want to say about a year ago, almost, I worked for a fast food company that we will not disclose the name of. And I worked under a man who we'll call Chad. Now, Chad, as we'll call him, was your typical run of the mill asshole, pretty much, for lack of better terminology. Thought he was better than everybody else, and was so good at his job, and just da 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 da, and he introduced himself at first as not only the manager of the store, but also the part owner of the store. And so, I got introduced to the rest of the crew, and we all, you know, we worked together for a few months, and Stuff started slowly deteriorating around the store. Cash deposits would go missing. Food would be stolen. Things weren't getting done as, as good as they should. And the employees were losing motivation. Why were the employees losing motivation, you ask? Because anytime they'd do something, even if they weren't doing anything, they'd get verbally berated by Chad. Now, I was one of the employees that got uh, verbally berated by Chad, and that definitely fucked with my psyche beyond all, all sorts of levels. But, so, round about January, I want to say, is when I finally decided I had had enough of Chad's shit, and I quit. I put in my two-week notice before the beginning of January, and January 1st, I walked out that door and I never looked back. But recently, I came into contact with one of the old shift managers that I used to work with in that same location, and come to find out that Chad had done all this stuff, like throwing a potato at an employee, and supposedly stealing money from the company and verbally berating pretty much everyone and blaming everyone for the store failing and yeah and throwing tantrums when things didn't go his way randomly firing people for crap reasons and come to find out Chad wasn't even a part owner in this store he was actually just another employee, like the rest of us. He was just a manager, that, that's it. He was an employee. He wasn't a part owner. He had no ownership in the company whatsoever. And so that definitely struck a chord with me as kind of interesting. And he got his just desserts, you know, corporate came down and kicked him out of the store, banned him from the store, and banned him, banned him from ever working for any of the companies, any of the uh, locations in that chain ever again. So, he got us just desserts. And, uh, yeah. So anyways, I just thought that was a pretty interesting story to share. If you got any similar stories of things that have happened to you like that, Go ahead and leave them down below in the comments. Leave your thoughts on that story down below in the comments. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe bell or hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. I upload pretty frequently. Sometimes I miss a day. Sometimes I don't. I've tried to put schedules on myself and really just no. <laughs> but I try my best to upload frequently. Anyways, guys, my name is John Aries, and I'll see you later.